Hello, everybody. Welcome back. This is Jonathan Gardner. I, I've been listening to my episodes. I think the volume for the music is turned down too low. Did I, did I change something here? Uh, it seems like it's normal. Let me just kind of turn it up here, and if if it gets annoying, you guys can tell me. Also, the microphone seems to be a little hot, so I'm not going to put my face right on top of it. Besides, after a while, I I kind of start slouching and stuff. Anyway, so I wanted to set up my um, the red engine type things. What is this? This is the actually I wanted to yeah let's let's, let's just build this and then we'll do batteries and then red circuits and then we'll build the other research. So everything from here on up basically. Engine units, electronic circuits. So we need to bring electronic circuits down. And here we are. I think I'm doing fine in the factory right now. I don't know everything, but um, I'm leaving a space there. I don't know how many. I think ten is probably plenty. Oh, I had a, I had a, a vision. Let me just finish that off really quick. I'm gonna show you what I was thinking about. So these red guys, what I should do instead, I'll show you is this. Um, let's go ahead and pick that up too. So I take the chest here and then I'm going to use a red, a blue inserter and then this is going to go up to there. I'm going to put those in there first. And same thing over here except this time I'm going to be a lot more careful. And maybe what I'll do is, oh no no stop stop please. Um, yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's try that again. Okay, go ahead. What I'm going to do is use these wires. Um, these guys, let's build a couple of those. And I'll hook it up here like that. And I'll say if there is, um, as long as that is equal to zero, and then I should be able to turn that off. Yeah, same thing here. So as long as the belts are equal to zero, and then we can turn that off. And this is going to be as long as the splitters are equal to zero. And turn that off. There we go. So once that runs out, it'll start filling it in again. And right now, probably should change it. Yeah, we'll fix it up later. All right, so we're going to bring in the red engines. Uh -huh. This is always, I never really liked the way that you have to lay this out if you want to do a compact form like I'm trying to do. And yellow should be perfectly fine. All right, and then we put down the medium power poles, which I don't have any of. I need to go pick some up. I'll just take them all. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I see you. I see you. I'm not forgetting you. I'll put some lights down as well. Let's put one over there too. All right, then we're gonna have the pipes with the lubricant come in here, which I probably should put pipes on the bus and I need some pipes, don't I? I have too many, too many of the chemical plants. So I need to put some back. Same way, I probably should uh, no, I'll just do... No, that's the furnaces. That's not chemical plants. Here's the chemical plants. I keep 16 on hand. That should be plenty. Uh, what did I want to get? I wanted to get pipes. Oh, pipes are on the bus. That's right. I would just be putting them in a chest. Had an idea about how to fix this as well. Here we go. I'll 
I'll just pick up some pipes here like this. Uh, it's more than 100. It's like 200 almost exactly I picked up there. So there's the pipes. Will you reach this far? Nope. I want you to reach at least this far. Yeah, perfect. And if you're going to go... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That'll line up with the blue belts when I put them in. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And should I, let's just do it here. Let's bring the liquids down here. <coughs> All right, where do I patch the liquids into the main bus here? I kind of have to go down here, don't I? Squeezing them through any other place but down there will probably not be very efficient. Oh, speaking of which, I need to unload. And then I'll have... Um, see, these guys require other things. Circuits, steel, batteries, electric engines. Um, I'll have a belt coming down with the reds. Then what I can do, what I was thinking of doing, is, so we'll have, this will pick up stuff, and then this will pick up from across that belt. So this belt can be a mixture of things, a mixture of steel and circuits, steel and circuits. Mm -hmm. And circuits go here. Oh, that is annoying. Steel is going to go here. Maybe I should do that. We'll save two spaces. Okay. So. Okay, we'll have 10 of these. I believe that these only are useful for robots. So I'm not planning on putting them on the main bus. I, I'm going to confirm though, just because I want to make sure I don't, uh, don't miss it up. Nope, that doesn't want it. That doesn't want it. That doesn't want it. And what is it called? Rockets or this one right here. This guy produces white science, that's right. Okay, so um, we can actually take these and shunt them off this direction. And then over here we can make our, oh, they need batteries too, two of them. So this will be the batteries. No, no, I do X1. That's what I do. That's way too many robot frames. And then we'll pull the batteries. Pulling the batteries there, we're going to drop off the products over here. Oh, I need one more. I can't make it. What do I need to make it? I'm missing iron plates. I'll just grab a couple here. All right.
and I forgot the red ones that go down here. Well, let's get those batteries rolling off the the pipeline. And probably bring red circuits along with the batteries so that I can because I think the logistic robots require red circuits. I could be wrong. Yeah, logistics are red circuits, and uh, gr those guys are green circuits. So what we'll do, and we'll put the box in the middle here, and we'll fill up this chest with stuff. So he's going to pick up the red circuits. He's going to make the construction bots, and she, he's going to make the logistic bots. So you're going to take that which is going to have red circuits and batteries on it. And then we're going to have this guy show up down here, which takes the frames. Uh-huh. This looks a little crazy. It is. It is. It is what it is. There you go. All right. Yeah, that got six of them. That's what I wanted to see. Let's put some lights in. How about we not put it there? All right, so next I want to make batteries and not a few of them. Question, should I bring in the pipes here? This is probably a good place to bring the pipes in. So let me do that. And so we're gonna have uh, water, petroleum gas, light oil, heavy oil, lubricant, um, sulfuric acid, something like that. We don't have water. Where, where's the closest water down here? Isn't it? Um, why don't I get the water coming up here right now? I can bring it back that way. These ones will be tight together. The other one, the one over here will be spread out. Um, so there'll be room to go back and forth. Hi, Jennifer. This will be water. I'll space these out by one on the main bus so they're easier to patch in and out of. Did I mess up? Why do I have belts over here? Oh, shoot. We're gonna go down here. We're gonna go out one more. Alright, let's set up a pump. Do I have any on me? Can I even make one? I can make one. Okay, there we go. There we go. Yeah, I don't know that these guys are actually being used. I'll find out in about a second here. Um, probably shouldn't be. Let's bring a medium power pole over here or something. Where does this go down to? That goes somewhere important, it looks like. These two are probably not doing anything. These guys are wired up. We don't need this guy here anymore. That guy's wired up, so we're happy. If you're happy, I you know it, clap your hands. What's up? What's going on? Where's that phone? It's right here, isn't it? Make Where? sure it's not the home phone. You're touching it, aren't you? There's nothing inside. Oh, he stole it again? That sneaky guy. Did I not? Come on. I need to make grenades. I think I'll make grenades as part of the military science. That one was big. Eh, nope. This will be the water. There.
You're texting for how long? What do you mean huh? texting for how long? I'm recording if you guys were wondering. There's gonna be one over here, one over there, one over there, one over there, and so on. No, no, I don't want to get pipes. He's in trouble. He's in trouble. This will be petroleum gas. Um, stupid trees. This is on the low setting. I mean, this is ridiculous the number of trees they give you in this game. All right, so. Let's do this. Let's go out all the way over here. Uh huh. There's that's gonna be light oil. Do I need heavy oil? Does heavy oil an ingredient in anything? Let me do a quick look on the internet. Um, <clears throat> installing Firefox updates. Great, thank you. That's exactly what I wanted you to do. Well, it's already done there. So, um, Factorio Heavy Oil. It's used for, I think, flamethrowers. Um, consumed by, yeah, flamethrower ammo, and that's pretty much it. I, I'm not going to be building much of that, so. Yeah, we're not, we're not going to put uh, heavy oil on the main bus. Uh, we'll do light oil, though. There's light oil. Skip the heavy oil. Um, lubricant. We need the lubricant. We, I'm kind of backwards here, but whatever. Okay, so what I want to do is execute a turn. And light oil. Wait, is light oil even used for much? I believe it is. Well, it's used uh, for flamethrower ammo as well. So we don't need light oil on the main bus at all. Let's not even bring the light oil down. Yoink. Just petroleum gas, sulfuric acid, and that's pretty much it. So... Why is there no... Oh, that's right. It's all being converted to lubricant. Okay. That's fine. It's kind of spread out there. Probably don't need so much space. Um, so the lubricant would fit right here. And the heavy oil, the light, the petroleum gas would go here. Shoot. Uh-huh. And it's 
wire them two up. If I were playing like Bob's mods or something like that, I would have a significantly worse time because the liquids are all used for everything. And I should do another Bob's mods run. I'm I'm really thinking about how I had everything organized and. Hello. Hi. How are you doing, Kayla? Stupid. So, this will be. That'll be stupid. Uh, let's move this one back a little bit. Leave some room, so we can go up and down like this. And then let's wire up the petroleum gas. Probably could arrange things differently. Okay, so the lubricant needs to come down to here. This is lubricant, and it's not lined up the way I wanted to. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I wanted to line it up according to eights so that they match the. Um, See, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, so they line up with the. Uh... Oh, what was I thinking? So, oh, that one doesn't need to be there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now yeah, this one's fine. It's not connecting though, is it? There, now it is. Okay, so lubricant. I don't know what that last liquid is. I think it's just sulfuric acid that I need to make. Okay, there's lubricant, and we need to get the lubricant down here. I don't know if it needs to extend any further than that. There's the lubricant. So we are making those red electric engine units. Look at that, that was beautiful. All right, now let's make our red science, our red circuits. No, let's do our batteries and then our red circuits. So batteries. Batteries requires sulfuric acid. Let's double check that. Batteries require sulfuric acid. Sulfuric acid comes from... Sulfur iron plates and water. Sulfur comes from water and petroleum gas. I just had the idea of combining everything together into one row. Dad? Yes, JJ. Want to play Super Fight? No. I don't want to play Super Fight. Um, iron and copper come down here, I guess. So, okay, let's say that we had, we're making sulfuric acid. This produces two sulfurs every second. This requires five sulfurs every second. Uh, I picked it a scab and now I'm bleeding off my chin from a shaving accident this morning. It was itchy. So the ratio is five of these to two of those. Okay, let's do that. Do -ba do. See, where do I start? I start here with the things. You're gonna make sulfur. And we need two of them. And sulfuric acid. Look 
requires water as well. Okay. Um, probably should reverse those because I only use a sulf the petroleum gas on the first one, the first two. And then I'll just use uh, these ones all the way down with the water. And we are going to use way too many of these guys. I'm not going to tap into the main line. I will attempt to tap here. And then up there. And then we're going to tap here into the petroleum gas. And that just so I can walk past it. That's it. So now we're making... What? I can't get past. That's not very nice. Come on! Really? Hmm. That's my concern, Kron. Mm. Okay, we need to get some power up there. Seriously? That's just rude. All right. So we have to make the sulfur and bring it down. And it's set to a second, but so let's just go ahead and let's just do that. It doesn't look like there's a problem. Okay, now we need to pull it down for our purposes. Needs five of them every second. Uh, now it needs a place for the gas to go, which uh, in my short-sightedness, I, I screwed that up. Okay, let's try let's try this. Let's see what this looks like. So we go like that. And then we go here. And they need iron plates. Right? So how many iron plates do they need? One. Iron plates. Um, need to upgrade these belts. Uh, that is the wrong one. I think I will separate actually out the batteries from the uh, there. Okay, now. How do we get the petroleum gas? Uh -huh. <laughs> I'm a sneaky, sneaky person, aren't I? Look at me. I almost know what I'm doing. This is what we do. <laughs> and there we go. 
There is petroleum gas on the bus. Let's just delete this just because. All right. Neatly, tightly patched through in a beautiful pattern. That means we have batteries. Now, batteries also require uh, copper plates and iron plates. And I was thinking I could just put that in line with this whole section. But uh, on second thought, I decided to make a second section for it because, well, I could have brought the iron plates down, but I, I don't know. I like this too much. Stupid trees. I need grenades. I'm making grenades. I can't get carbon or coal. I, I can't believe that I'm making grenades. I, I set the trees to that low setting and, and even then they're a nuisance. Can I make grenades like this? Do I have? Yeah. All right. Oh, so annoying. The trees are just the worst. And here I am trying to play vanilla. Hmm. Maybe I should do modded with something tree killers or something like that. Ah, Bob's mods. I haven't done angels oars. I understand that's a slog. Okay, so these guys take petroleum gas and they produce batteries. I'll just make One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, batteries. We'll just produce one row. We really don't need tons of batteries except for the uh, whatchamacallums. Um, you know what they're called, the accumulators. Okay, so let's do this. Let's go. Uh, let's go right here. Take all the stuff I don't want. And let's just put the pipes down. There we go. And we will bring in the copper. It's just one of each, isn't it? Yeah, it is. It takes five seconds to make, so. The copper and the iron. Let me go get the copper. The last time I used copper was to make uh, power poles on that section that I built. Oh, I'm out of red belts. That's not good. 2,000 of them is a lot. way and where it's gonna go I don't know yet well that is uh, unfortunate I'll figure that out later that's why I play this game you know it's because of these little interesting things that happen um, when you try to lay out your design, these little nooks and crannies, you have to, it's like a puzzle. You run into them every once in a while, not often, but you do run into them. And when you do run into them, it gives you time to think. There's usually not a rush to just put something down that works right away, but you get to think about it a little bit, come up with better things, you know? All right, there we go. Just one half of the belt is going to be batteries. Um, so I need to make this guy Mm. 
Where am I going to have him go? Let's bring up the last belt of coal, I believe. I don't see the coal. It must be really far down there. There it is. What is this? What is this for? These are just in the way, aren't they? How many did I put down? There we go. Almost to red circuits. Maybe I'll get it done before the end of this episode. Who knows? Let's actually ride the belt. Please don't run into anything. Of course, of course, it's going to run into that, isn't it? Okay. I was getting the coal to see how far away stuff is. And because the red belts are not quite... I'll just go their maximum distance. And we're gonna have some go up and some go down. <laughs> I did it again, didn't I? Here, let's do it this way. So many batteries. And this needs to go here, right over here. Um, Let's go ahead and distribute these batteries here. You can have some. And we're making robotic frames. We're making construction robots, actually. And so let's go ahead and hook that up there. And let's do this red wire. We're going to say as long as the construction robots are less than 100, I'm sure. Here comes the frames. There we go. I'm making one a second, so in a few minutes we'll have it all done. Oh wait, we need to do something here. And also, I need to put this into a chest. Um, the inserter there. I don't know how many I need. How's my power? Power's fine. Yeah, it's red circuit time. I have this design that I came up with for the red circuits that I'm really proud of, and I like to use it again and again. And I don't know what your guys' opinion of it is, but I like it. Stupid trees. They're just so stupid, you know? Oh, I'd turn them off, but you need trees to get the game started. All right, so red circuits require uh, plastic, which comes from coal, and petroleum gas, copper, and electronic circuits. Let's look at the ratios here. So it takes six seconds. It requires two electronic circuits, four copper cables. So if we had 12 factories on a side, 
which is a one copper cable is produced every half second, I believe. Copper cables every half second produces two, right? So one copper cable factory could produce enough for 24 actually. No, because it requires four. So yeah, one to six, that's the ratio, one to six. Let's put two copper cable factories, so two to 12. This plastic bars, we need two every six seconds. And this produces two every second. So let's leave room for two of these guys and two of the copper cables. I need some more um, things. Uh, the chemical plants, I need like four of them. I'm gonna do two of those, two of those. I think I have plenty of factories. I should have enough, yes. There you are. I'll take that, thank you very much. Oh, I wanted to put red circuits on the other side of this so that this guy can pick up the red circuits and make logistic robots. All right. So we're going to set it up thusly. And then he's going to make plastic bars from petroleum gas. We're going to have room here for the copper to come in. Then we're going to have two Actually, he can go straight up here, right? I believe he can. I have two of these guys making copper cables. And that'll come down here, and then it'll go down here. And we'll have 12. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Yes, I'm making a ridiculous number of red circuits. that's the way it's going to work. So petroleum gas comes in here. There it is. That's where I want it to be. I think. Nope, that's wrong. Yeah, here. All right. And then we're gonna have two belts like this coming in and the output belt here. And then we need the green circuits to go on the, uh, this is not the right spot, is it? This needs to be smooth down one. We can use yellows. We already have the stack inserter bonus. Okay, we're gonna try. what the design looks like. Because I want to get it on the inside. That doesn't seem elegant. Here, let's do this.
This seems more elegant, so green circuit toe. Uh, you know what? There we go. That's important. Alright, now it's mirrored on the other side. Let's put the power poles in. I imagine there's room for them, right? Oh, I'm not bringing the coal. Where's the coal? Every second it needs one piece of coal, right? Let's do this. There we go, coal right there. That's where we're gonna bring coal in, right down there. Did I measure that right? I did. Well, that is mildly annoying, is it not? Yeah, that's exactly where I want it. Okay, so Mr. Um, Batteries, you can't go there. You're going to go somewhere else. Now we need copper. Oh, this is even more garbage here. That's a word, by the way, garbage here. If you want to speak English, yep, that's one of the words you have to learn. Okay, there's the coal, there's the copper. Ah, I need more of those. Can't go that way. Oh, they're down here. That's right. Yellow inserters. Thank you. I have so much coal. You don't have petroleum gas. We're out of petroleum gas already. Did I cut it off or something? Or now oh, we're just out. He, oh, is he, what, is he hooked up there? Is that has none? All right, we just need to turn the petroleum gas back on and figure out what, what turned it off. Um, Sue, so what I would like to do actually. That's not going to do anything, is it? I'm going to assume that we can get enough capacity through this that it'll be okay. All 
All right, um, let's go turn the petroleum gas back on, see what's going on there. That's drained. It's all gone. All gone. We're probably full of something. No, we're not. We're full of light oil. Oh, that's that's almost full. That is full, in fact. Well, there's two choices. I'm going to preserve the light oil that we do have. I'm going to be using it soon. So that should turn that back on. Yes, there we go. And remember to research advanced oil processing as soon as possible. So 12, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Pull down the circuits and the green. No, 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 I want it here. I have red inserters pushing it out. I'm going to be short one because I had 23 before I started. Actually, I think I'm going to be using more. We just give these guys power and we should be in business. And just mirror that down here. We probably already made a couple. Yep, we did. Okay, now let's get these out onto the main bus next to the batteries. I think I need to bring them down here for some of the construction that I'm doing. And other than that, there's just research I want to do on top. All right, let's set up the other side which is basically a mirror image. <laughs> copy and paste, paste. We're going to have... Will that stretch the whole way? It will. And then... Power pole. Excellent. We have red inserters, I believe. Which there's no reason why it shouldn't be the other way around. But okay, so we need some coal coming here. I believe that's the coal. I need more underground belts. I'm low on splitters too. Alright. Now let's bring in the copper. My bus is a mess. Every time I do this, it always turns out slightly differently. I know sometimes I stumble upon a really awesome design, but 
I like designing new designs. That's why I play this game. So what am I using? I'm using yellow inserters. Mm, mouse jump. All these trees need to go. They've got to go. You've got to go back. Just some power poles here and here. Do I have? I need some more inserters, red inserters. Oh, stones. Remember to get the red inserters. Oh, my inventory's full. That's terrible. Um, it's that stupid wood there. The stone's not helping either. If the devs are listening, it's too many trees. It's too many trees. Alright, let's go get some more red inserters before I forget. I'm gonna need a lot of red inserters. I need like 24. No, just 12. I'll take 50. Batteries aren't helping. Here. Somebody wants batteries, I can tell. Have some batteries. Okay, so insert from behind in the middle. And on the side here, offset. And then exert. We're not making nearly enough petroleum gas. And now for power poles. Now for lights. Yeah, that guy's not getting any petroleum gas, and it's not like it's full or something, anything like that. It's just, just taking a long time to make. Like full capacity on the oil, the crude oil. These guys are running full time. It's just we need more of them. All right, let's get that science going. All right, blue science. Engines. Oh, engines need to go on the bus. Forgot about that. No, wait. No, let's think about this logically. Yes. If we're gonna have one engine a second, we need 10 engine construction things. So let's just take this and put it on the bus. On to the bus you go. Beyond the red circuits. And I think we'll do that next episode. I'm going to take a break here. So let me just put a thing down here and remind myself that I want to make that. And also that I want to make the military science. And I want to have a belt that goes between them. Like that. Military science and blue science. This guy needs one electric mining drill a second. An electric mining drill takes... How long does it take? It takes two seconds to make. So I need two electric mining drill factories of full capacity. Let me put that down. I'm 
and this guy requires ammo and grenades and gun turrets. Gun turrets require nothing. Ammo requires ammo, requires steel and copper and iron and grenades is copper and coal, iron and coal. All right, guys, thanks for watching. We'll continue next time. Take care. Bye-bye.